In this video, I am going to show you how to download and install Voodoo 17 in Windows. Open the browser, search in Google Voodoo 17 download or you can directly go to voodoo.co then find the download button. You can start the download. After selecting the download link, you need to enter the details then select the Windows version and download the Community Edition. Now the download is started. Once after downloading, whether you can install from the download window itself or you can directly install from the download location. Here I am using from the download location. Open the installation file. Then confirm the user access control. Select the language and press the next button. Agree the license agreement. Installation having three options. One is Voodoo server and PostgreSQL server. The second one is Voodoo server only. The third one is Voodoo IoT. Here I am selecting Voodoo server and PostgreSQL server. Then press the next button. This is the installation details of database. Need to press next button. Here we can select the destination of installation. I am using default destination. I am just pressing install button. Now the installation has been started. Here I am doing the fast forwarding for avoiding the video lagging. Don't forget to connect the internet while on the installation. Otherwise the installation will not occur properly because some installation file will be download and install automatically. Now our installation has been completed. We need to press next button. If we are enabling the checkbox of start Voodoo button, it will start Voodoo automatically. I am just selecting and pressing the finish button. Now the Udo is loading. Now our Udo installation has been finished. We need to create the database for the Udo system login. First we need to set the master password. The master password will be same for all Udo database. I am entering the master password, database name and email id, password. This password is using for accessing the same database. After filling up details, we can press on create database. This is for live database creation. So don't select demo data. Then press the create button. Now our new database is creating. Now our database is ready for login. I have login with the same email ID and password which I have entered already. Now our Odoo is ready for using. If you want to activate any apps, here, for example, if you want to activate sales modules, we can press the active button. Now the sales module has been activated. If you want to take the backup of this database, we need to log out the existing login. Then press the manage database. Here we, we will get the option for managing the database, including option for backup, duplicate, delete and restore the database. Here we are showing how to take the backup. First to press the backup button, then we need to enter the master password. We need to select the backup format. Here we will get two options. One is including file store and without file store. Includes file store means it will contain all the documents. Without file store means only the database backup. Then select the backup format. Then press the backup button. It will start to take the backup. Now the backup has been finished. If you want to duplicate the same database, we can press the duplicate button. Now I am going to show you how to restore the database. Press the restore database option. Then select the database backup. Then enter the master password. Then type the new database name. In this purpose, this is a database copy. So we need to select the database is a copy. The other option is database was moved. Moved means from other Udo or we need we are changing the location. So in this purpose, we are using copy of the same database. So this is a database copy. We need to select and press continue button. Now our database has been restored. Here we can see no database is available. Here we can see no database is available. If you want to login, we can login with the same database after selecting. Now we have login with the new database. 
Thank you for watching this video. If you like the video, please press the like button, share and subscribe.